Hi, and welcome to another edition of Strategic Business Insights. Today we're gonna to talk about growth and volatility. Growth and volatility. So you'll see behind me, uh, this is a map that I had created with some of the research that I've done in terms of demographic growth around the world. And there's a lot of, this incredible variation between different countries and the demographic growth. In other words, their population growing or not growing, or in fact, even shrinking around the world. You get countries like Japan and Germany where their, their populations are actually shrinking. Uh, and so the economy is not gonna be growing that much because the actual population is getting smaller. So consumer spending is smaller and everything gets smaller as a result. And then you get a number of countries that are basically staying flat in terms of their population, where you talk about uh, countries like the UK, the United Kingdom, France is very stable. Meanwhile, America is growing a little bit. Uh, believe it or not, China, their population is growing for the next five to 10 years, but then it tops out and starts going down. But where's the most dynamic growth? Well, the most dynamic growth by far is in South Asia and Africa and a little bit in Southeast Asia. So what am I talking about in particular? Well, Southeast Asia, we're talking about countries like Indonesia and the Philippines. The Philippines is exploding in terms of growth. Their population is growing. India, their population is growing very quickly. Even though China, their population is topping out and it's gonna be going down, the Indian population is gonna to continue to grow. And then you have all these countries in Africa, uh, like Egypt and the Sub-Saharan Africa, like, like uh, Kenya and Nigeria and Sudan and all these different places, even Iraq, which is not, in, of course, in, in, uh, in Africa, but Iraq, the population is growing very quickly because they have a high birth rate, okay? Now, that growth is gonna translate into economic growth as well. All those people have to eat food and they have to wear clothing, they have to have shelter. A lot of them are gonna want transportation like cars or motorcycles or bicycles. That's all consumer spending. So there's gonna be a lot of growth in those countries, but it's also gonna be volatile like crazy. Like if you go and try and grow your business in Africa, it's chaotic. You go to Nigeria, you go to Lagos, you go to to Kenya, these places are very chaotic and there's corruption and there's poverty on the streets and there's all sorts of crazy things. If you've gone to these places, you know what I'm talking about. Even to a lesser extent, you go to India and it's chaotic. There's people everywhere and there's garbage and trash and animals and people and rich people and poor people and all kinds all mixed together. It's chaotic, it's volatile, right? It's not easy to, to capitalize on that growth, but it's the people who, who embrace it in that chaotic stage that have the greatest opportunity for growth in the long run. Who, who was the one who set up a business right at the beginning when it was still chaotic, when it was still a mess, when it was still volatile? If, you're, if you wanna grow your business, or if you wanna take advantage of the dynamic growth that's taking place in some of these countries, primarily in Africa, but also places like the Philippines and places like India, you have to be willing to go into that chaos and leverage the situation, find a way to make it work. And it's gonna be scrappy and it's gonna be messy. But if you find a way to get things to work in this chaotic stage, you'll have a footprint which will grow as the growth in those economies materializes. We already know it's coming. The population is coming, right? The children have already been born, right? We just have to wait for them to grow up and become adults themselves to see that economy grow. And it's gonna be volatile and it's gonna be messy, but that's where the growth opportunity is. So true growth and volatility in many cases is synonymous. You have to embrace that volatility to leverage that growth. Thanks so much for watching this video. My name is Patrick, reminding you as always to think bigger about your business. Think bigger about your life.